maintenance items today. First off, this little button guy. This it goes on to your door, it keeps it upright into the wing. So it's right here. And then that clips into the wing clip here, keeps your door up when you're getting in and out. And they tend to break fairly easily. Second item, there's a service bulletin for the Pipistrelle. The factory plane came with two batteries in parallel. They are twice the amperage as the other batteries that are in there. Because Pipistrelle said this is a drop-in replacement. And this battery has a plug here. You can actually wire it to your avionics and it'll tell you the status of the battery. Really nice battery. Um, it's got some built-in faults. If, it, if it's getting too much charge, it'll actually shut the battery off so it doesn't explode. So I am just going to install this one battery. I'm not going to install two because uh, the Pipistrelle dealer in Canada here, he put only one in his plane and said it had tons of power for his uh, engine. It's pretty easy to get out the battery. You have to take off this back panel. It's a few screws and then you can slide this out. I took the other battery out on the other side, and now I just have the one battery on this side. There's the panel, and there's the battery. So there's the battery. The Lion battery is quite a bit taller, which doesn't matter to fit. EarthX battery, the new one, is quite a bit thicker, but the box that Pipistro made has foam around this, so maybe it'll squish in and that'll fit. And lengthwise, they're the same. You can see here it's right in that box, which is great. Guys, I got it installed here. It's working. Next up, the little guy here. To replace these are basically just some picks or something to go in those holes and then it just spins off inside there. So I got some little picks here. And there it is, your broken latch. Just take the new one, spin the cap off. And plug her in. There you go. Fixed. I picked this up yesterday. Series 2. Because the Series 3 is basically the same as the Series 2. Not sure how useful it is when you're flying, but I got the 4 flight app for it on here. Hey guys, well, let's see how it starts the new battery. Caution. Very nice. Good start. Seemed to be a little bit better than the old batteries. Definitely show when it's colder out. See no traffic. Technically, there can be planes here without radios. That's why you want to check. Make sure there's no traffic. Remember I told you I got this watch? Yeah, I kind of bought it. 
for myself for my birthday present. I uh, had a pretty tough day when I wrecked my pedo tube, which you guys saw in the last video if you didn't watch it. So yeah, now I'm flying with this new Apple Watch. That's pretty cool, I can get text messages now when I fly. Not really sure how useful it is for flying, but uh, we'll... Do you guys have any suggestions of what I can use my Apple Watch for when I'm doing my work up here? Let me know in the comments below. Hey, I'll put you guys over here. There you go. Can you see well? Hope so. Thank you guys for the comments about what to do for the pedo tube uh, to protect it so I don't hit it again. Um, I put all my jerry cans basically around here temporarily. This is going to be my temporary fix, but I think I will still mount a foam block with some suction cups on it to the wing. Um, that way I don't need all this, but that'll definitely keep me away from the pedo tube again.